Okay, Fred and Keith back here for Get the Most Out of Your Workout. This week's edition, we're going to talk about a popular stretching exercise that you guys have done down at the box. You guys call it the walking T. We're actually going to flip it around a little bit more detail. It's actually a single leg Romanian deadlift. Let me have Keith demonstrate this for you here. Walking T is down at the box. You see this one leg stance. You reach down, and then you stand back up, and he goes to the next leg. We want to take out the reaching down to the ground. Do that again for me, Keith, and let's talk about spine angles. We've talked about squats quite a bit. You notice how we want three points of contact on that spine angle. In a walking T, we lose that. So we're going to get stability, three-dimensional, most mobility stability. Here's our mobility, that stance hamstring. Well, we want stability through the spine angle. So we want to see that spine angle straight with this back leg all the way up so we're getting a good mobility in that front hip. Keith's a little tight in that hip flexor, so he lacks a little bit of motion. Ideally, we want that foot to be at the same height as the head. In this position, Keith should be feeling a really intense hamstring lengthening. Go ahead and come up for a second, Keith. Let that rest a second. Ideally, we're only going to stay there for two or three seconds. But in that position, we've got to look at another angle. So go ahead and go down into that position. And Keith's doing better at getting his pelvis to get into this hip socket. So think of your pelvis as a steering wheel. As you're balancing on that one leg, you've got to turn that so that horizontally we're neutral as well. And that's going to get the most out of stabilizing that hip socket so the hamstring feels more stretched. Go ahead and come back up. So we're getting a good combination of mobility through the stance leg and the hamstring, mobility in the leg that's up with the hip flexor, but at the same time working a lot on the stability through the hip socket itself, through the spine angle. You want to get more out of this exercise, we brought in a kettlebell. Keith's going to demonstrate how you can get into this position, stabilize through the left hip. Now he's going to do an upright row with that right side, now we've got a good posture exercise through here. Just another way you can get the most out of your workout with a single leg Romanian deadlift, getting the mobility, getting the stability, even getting a little bit of a posture workout. We're going to try this at the box this week, see how it goes. Get the most out of your workouts. Fred and Keith, see you next time.